Welcome to our new Petroleum Engineering Building. This is so spectacular when you walk in. One step inside the new Terry Fuller Petroleum Engineering Research Building and you'll see what sets it apart. The $22.8 million addition to the north end of the Engineering Key boasts more than 42,000 square feet of modern classrooms, laboratories, and cutting edge technology. From innovative displays. And the first thing you see is our geologic rock wall here. And what this rock wall tells the story of is the evolution of well bores. To aesthetic detail, students in the Bob L. Hurd Department of Petroleum Engineering will benefit from every thought put into the new building. Equipped with cutting edge laboratories, students will gain a hands-on approach while learning the entire spectrum of petroleum exploration and production. These facilities include the Apache Upstream Research Center, also known as the Visualization Lab. So this is a unique lab. Uh, this is what we call a visualization lab, which we don't have anything like that right now. And the idea here is to build experiments, models, etc. They'll help the students visualize what we're teaching them. The Occidental Petroleum Enhanced Oil Recovery Laboratory and the Pioneer Natural Resources PVT Laboratory. Research done in these two labs will help enhance and extend oil well productivity. The Anadarko Unconventional Technology Center. This is what we call uh, our unconventional laboratory. Uh, this is where we look at unconventional rock shales and research how best to extract oil and gas most efficiently, I should say, out of that type of rock. In the Michael Hurd Fracturing and Production Laboratory. And that's where we'll be doing a lot of rock mechanics and production. Another eye-catching aspect lies in the two-tiered classrooms. Massive HD screens measuring 115 square feet. We can animate stuff, we can play videos of in the oil field. If we had 3D images and, and things like that, that's what I really like. Since Texas Tech University has consistently graduated top-notch sought-after engineers, it was important to give them an edge when entering the workforce. We'd like to emulate as much as we can uh, what they'll see when they get out in industry. This is where our drilling simulator stations, we'll have four stations in here, one there, one there, one there. Well, the student actually will see the drilling rig, the floor of the drilling rig, and things moving, and will, and actually industry has the same thing. And they simulate wells taking a kick, getting ready to blow out and do kind of bad things, and you know, what do you do in this type of situation? While they're becoming our future engineers within the walls of these innovative labs, students can take comfort knowing their safety was the primary objective. Safety was of the utmost parameter when we designed these labs. So, being mercury, which is dangerous, hazardous. This room is negative pressure, so no fumes, nothing can leak out. And though this building is primarily for learning, it's also a place where students can relax and hang out while still staying focused. This is our student lounge, um, and what I did in here was make it much more of a relaxing atmosphere. Uh, like for instance, I replaced all the chairs with couches so the students can crash. This new building serves as a place where the future's best petroleum engineers learn, while being a testament to Texas Tech's commitment to excellence. And trust me, I've been to all the other universities, and there is nothing like this. Everything you could possibly think of as far as state-of-the-art technology and how to do it, we got it. This is Lacey Nobles for Texas Tech Today.